the project that the class did for this senior digital imaging course was to build an image intensifier. Image intensifier is a diagnostic unit that they use in the clinical site for x-ray intensification. Um, they use it throughout their entire career. It's used in numerous areas of the diagnostic imaging department. Um, in the past, the project, the actual class, has done nothing but lecture on what this device does and its components. Um, I decided to take that to another level and basically assigned this project as a 3D construction. Uh, the students are required to create a 3D image intensifier. They don't get any prior lecture. It is all student learning um, and they have to research it. So they have their textbook, they have the internet, they have a variety of resources that they can utilize to find out what is an image intensifier and how does it work. The requirements of the course are that it has to be a 3D project, it has to be a 3D object, not a post, not a poster board, but an actual 3D structure. It has to be accurate with respect to the size, not the size of an actual II, but the components within the II have to be accurate and to, what do you call it, to size, I guess, to proportionate. Um, they need to be able to explain what each structure does. So when the x-rays leave the patient and hit the beginning part of the image intensifier, the students are required to talk about the different components in the order of how the x-rays transfer through the, through the uh, object, what occurs at every individual stage. There's a variety of conversions that occur during this um, process of x-rays in and x-rays out that perform the diagnostic image and they are required to explain those conversions from x-ray to light to energy back to light and ultimately the image. So it, the students usually really enjoy it because it's a hands-on thing. People tend to learn back in kindergarten. Students didn't want to look at, you know, paintings, hand paintings and those things. They wanted to do them. They didn't want to look at somebody playing in the sandbox. They want to be playing in the sandbox. So for them to build it, they freak out a little bit when they get the assignment because they know they're not going to get any lecture on it. They're going to have to come up with this themselves. But they have fun. It, they really learn what it's all about. So when we go in and meet with them and they have to explain what the project is and what each piece does, it makes a lot more sense to them because they actually put the piece together and they now understand how it works when they finish the whole project.